yung pointing of the toes. Ako yung pointing, pointing, pointing of the toes. <laughs> no, no, I think, yung sa akin kasi, I think one of the things that I learned, no, um, the discipline is, is yung pagiging, uh, kung dati, uh, ako ay isang uh, performer na laging nipitik yung katawan and I'm very conscious about my musicality. I think right now, madami uh, pa akong mas marami pa akong natutunan sa mga dancers na to. Na dati, uh, during my time, kung may hit ang isang kanta, ba, 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 syempre, ang dating, I'll, I'll hit it a certain way, no? Pero, I'm learning from them the discipline of doing something na hindi in-expect ng tao, kahit na naririnig na rin sa tuktog yung kanta. Ibahin mo ang dati. And that, for me, is one thing that I has really opened up my mind. The discipline of being able to approach something uh, and going away from what you've learned and applying the new things that you've learned. At hindi ko masasabi na ano ah, tulad ako ni, ni Maha or, or Billy na he went to school, you know, he would rehearse all the time. Ako kung ano lang lang, hindi lang naman magpuso ko, yun lang lang ang ginagawa ko palagi. But learning and, and, and going beyond the norm and the discipline of being able to hear things and then visualizing things in a different way. I think that's what I've learned. That's, what, that's one thing I'm trying to apply. Thank you. 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 Na, yung mga contestants, nakikita ko sila na sumasayaw sila from competition. And then sabi ko, iba, i, iba yung passion talaga nila. So parang ako, nandun yung pukasyonin ko yung sarili ko din na ah, okay yung ba yung musicality ko? Front, front mate ba ako? O nangunguna ba ako sa music? Kaya niya, hindi ko hindi ko maiwasan i-check din yung sarili ko lang minsan kapag nagsasayaw. At saka in fairness po sa lahat ng contestants, kahit na rehearsals lang, parang walang hindi silang nagmamarking. Pull out po, pull out sila. Minsan kasi, uh, isa din daw po kasi sa technique eh, para, lalo na sa amin, pag sa asa, parang you only have one hour to rehearse. So, kailangan talaga, pag nag-rehearse ka, ito todog na, pull out na kaagad. Kasi, para kumapit na sa iyo kagad yung dance, yung music. Para maganda yung kakalabasan. Pero yun nga, tulad ng mga napag-uusapan namin ni Tito Garnet at saka ni, ni Billy, para-parais kami halos na pag rehearsal, ang ganda nung nabibigay namin. Tapos pagdating na sa stage, nandun din yung kaba, kahit na hindi competition. Minsan parang mas happy ka pa dun sa rehearsal. So, yun, yun po. One last for, for the host. I'm interested in what are the dynamics, what are the, the things, Pia, what, what are the things that you've learned from, from Luis and Luis? What did you get from Pia? Yeah. Um, definitely I learned a lot from Luis. Um, He's really someone to look up to, especially when it comes what? to hosting. <laughs> oh! <laughs> To, um, because kaya niyang English na ma talagang magaling, Tagalog din, pwede seryoso, pwede funny, like he knows when to be funny and he knows when to be funny. Like it's, uh, sometimes I find myself watching him and observing him and I actually do this a lot. Kasi minsan magkahiwalay kami sa backstage ako, um, I send off the contestants and then they come back to me, winners, they come back to me. And then I watch him some monitor and I observe but when it's my turn, I know I also know what to do. So definitely, I learned a lot from movies. And uh, you, you may not know this, but you really, you really taught me a lot. Aww. Aww. <laughs> now, uh, before I answer your question, besides having an amazing creative team, um, we should not yet acknowledge the direct John Paul Yes. 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 Kumbaga, when I co-hosted with Billy sa Got Talent, syempre may mga certain dynamics kami ni Billy na 
I cannot necessarily apply to Pia or to Tony <laughs> or to Alex. So, parang every single time, na, and well, like well, what the judges said, that there's no matter how good you believe you are, no matter how good people say you are, the moment you think that there's nothing new to learn, that's when everything goes down. To so, para sa akin, every new partnership, every new show, parang there's something new to learn. So, it could be Pia, but it's my first time to be with her, so at least the next time. And as each taping progresses, para alam po yung tamang kinta, if ever I get to work with her again, or at least someone similar to her. Thank you, yeah, for the kind words. Yeah, we are down to our last two questions, but we'll give you ample time for you to interview me. Okay? Um, we have a question from Natalie Tomala of the Philippine Star. Go, Nat. Hi, um, my question was actually last year. First one, how many of you have been here? Wow. Good question. I wish I knew. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a good problem to have. Na, I simply started to mix, tapos sa asa, tapos sa tuloy tuloy na. So, sumatotal kung ilang shows, ano yung mga season, na kailang season na I honestly have no idea. Thank you. I'm gonna look into that. Thanks. So, ito, question ko rin. For the June, since Sir Carly mentioned earlier na sa mga fans, mentors, you all have dance mentors. So, can you just share na lang your story on story how you got into dancing? Sige mga dance mentors. Interesting. This is the reason why I got yeah. into dancing. Yeah. Let's be honest. I mean, it's me that. And who knows this? Because hey, um, I remember uh, being, sorry, like four and a half years old, and being in the music museum at that time. And napakalaki ng show ng pads niya pa nyo. So may afro pa siya ng bonte, di ba? Um, that's what made me realize that I want to be like him. So, we Gary is the reason why I'm actually in this mind right now. Um, and then through Kui Gary, because of his influences, then like Michael Jackson, James Brown, Elvis Presley, and all those performers, na tutunan ko rin na mahalin sila. But in all fairness, actually, Kui Gary started. That's my mentor. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, with me, I don't have a mentor as in isang tao dito sa Pilipinas na nagturo sa akin o uh, was guiding me through it. Uh, maybe except for my sister Gina, who used to dance before at Tumabuchas sa dance finals in Dance 10. 